Hello students, today's tutorial will be on set theory. So let's get started. Now let us first read the question which we will be solving in this tutorial. The question is, a survey shows 63% of Americans like cheese whereas 76% like apples. Okay, so let us first so suppose or let a denotes the set of americans who like cheese okay and let B denote those Americans who like apple. Okay. Now it is given to be 63% and 76%. So let us make one more assumption. So let the population. of America B 100 okay then given we have that a survey shows 63% of Americans like cheese whereas 76 like apples we can write so then N A will be 63 and NB will be 76. Let us read the second half of the question now. If X percent of Americans like both cheese and apple, then we need to choose the appropriate option. So, now let us see what will be the union of these two sets. So, now... And A union B can be rewritten as set A plus set B less the intersection part of the two sets. Okay. So we have something like this. That A intersection B is equal to 139 which is nothing but the addition of these two sets less A union B. Isn't it? So we have just reversed this and this two terms. Now we know that A union B will be less than or at most equal to 100. Okay. And so we need to show that the intersection of these two sets will be greater than or equal to 39. That is 139 less 100. Okay. Now let me insert a page. And change the color. So, further what we have is A intersection B belongs to A and A intersection B belongs to B. Okay? This implies that a intersection B is less than equal to the set A itself and so this is A intersection B and A intersection B similarly is less than equal to the set B. This means that this A intersection B must be less than 
set a which is nothing but 63 and a intersection b must also be so this should also be less than less than equal to 76 which is nothing but this so initially we got that a intersection b should be greater than equal to 39 and here we have 63 so i am considering this so if i'll consider these two combining these two we can say that the range of a intersection b will be this and denoting this as x the x range of x will lie between these two numbers so now let us check the options given to us so given the option we can clearly say that c is the correct answer for the, this particular question so the percentage of americans who like both cheese and apple lies between this range so that's it in this particular tutorial in our next tutorial on set theory we will do some other sums so stay tuned